just I'm devastated for our, for our kids because they, they, they fought like heck to come back in that game. Eames going to back it down against two defenders. Instead, kicks it out. Right wing three, Reed Kemp is good. It's six to six, all three-pointers so far. Dixon feeds it to Swader, and Swader right back to Dixon with a one-handed thunder dunk. And it's now Northeastern State 32, Missouri Western 18, and that is a 5-0 run for the Griffs. Swader gets a screen from John, and now Swader feeds it to Fields. Left wing three, that's good. Northeastern led it by as many as 18. Griffin's got it back down to nine. And Northeastern State will take a 42 to 30 lead into the locker room. Stolen by John Anderson Jr. And he goes up for the dunk and he nails it. John Anderson Jr. seeing his first minutes off the bench here in the second half. Jerron Thame seeing just his fourth appearance in the 12th game of the season. There he is with a steal in the mid court and he takes it to the basket on the right side, puts it up and in. Oh, I felt great to be back. Uh, basketball is the thing I love. So just me sitting out from basketball has been real tough. So just, I'm just happy to be back playing with my brothers once again. Clubber three, got it! Do you believe in miracles? Northeastern 71, Missouri Western 64. 9.2 seconds left. Long airmail pass inbounds. What are you thinking? In the intercepted by Will Eames. Griffins for the tie. Five seconds left. Goal! Julius Dixon, the hero, tie game with .6 to go. They called a shooting foul in the backcourt. Oh, they called a foul. They call a foul on Missouri Western. We as human beings, we we make mistakes. Um, sometimes they're more magnified than, than others. Um, and so right now we're focused on picking our brother up.